Okay, so this is 11,098 square feet. Mm. Free hole? 61 million 38,000. Net price, this is the most expensive one. <laughs> Hi everyone, Property Lim Brothers. Now today we are invited to do a special tour edition for Far East In Essence Luxury Penthouse Series. All of them are freehold and right here in Orchard. You are in for a treat today because we will be showing you not one but three super penthouses worth a total of $143 million. Now the first stop is at Elba Penthouse. Check out this place with us. Okay, so we are at this Elba penthouse and this is the ginormous living and dining room with this extremely high ceiling height. I think it's about 5 plus meters. 6,437 square feet of space, 5 bedrooms plus a study, 6 bathrooms, separate living, dining, separate balcony, water feature, decking, private pool, outdoor, roof terrace space and a private jacuzzi, separate helper's room separate family's room, wet and dry kitchen and the store, 18th floor and you are at the highest point. Private lift, you almost have everything you need. This is a single floor plate penthouse, very rare. You don't have to climb in stairs, your luxury living that you're looking for. Probably you're asking why are we showing you a bare unit. It is actually done on purpose. Because the buyers have the flexibility to uh, do up their own space. You can plan your own layout. Whoever the eventual buyer is, once the buyer pays the booking fee, confirms the unit, signs the SMP, the renovation will then begin. Why? Because the buyer can then get a brand new luxury penthouse when they collect their keys. This is the living room, the dining room, and the balcony. And you have this huge panels of window space, right smack out both angles, greenery view right in front of you, you are higher than most of the buildings over here. And this is the view of Marina Bay Sands. Hey Istana, that's, uh, that's Istana. So you are sitting in your living room, watching your TV or you are having your meals and you are looking at this every day and you have every view from here. This is the balcony, there is also a water feature here. This is your deck, that's the planter deck as well. When you reach home for your private lift, if you turn left, there'll be a living and dining, and then if you walk straight, you'll reach your dry kitchen here, the entire dry kitchen with an island. Wow. Your wet kitchen is over here, which is why you can see the refuse uh, shoot over at that side. They're going to design a whole wet kitchen. And then this walkway, will then lead to your entire bedrooms here. This is going to be a four bedroom plus study plus family room. Every room has very good wardrobe size. The first bedroom as you enter, the wardrobe will be on the left. This is the entrance to the Jack and Jill toilet. Over here you have your bedroom. You can put your bed over here. And the fantastic view up. from the bedroom. You're just taller than all the rest of the buildings around you. This is going to be the centre walkway. As you can see, this is the family area here. You can plant your TV, your couch, bean bags, and everything is all here. Second bedroom here, the third one on the left. This is actually a small study. And then this whole area here is your master room, your bed head, your uh, television point. Coming in here, left and right will be your walk-in wardrobe. And this whole Space here will be your ensuite bar for your master. The important thing is check out this view from your master room. Simply fantastic. When you own this Y shaped layout, Elba penthouse is worth $30 million. You enjoy view from 360 degrees. You want view from any angle, you get it. Just check this out. Simply fantastic. Now, Vin, shall we have a game of badminton over here? We can play badminton over here. <laughs> okay. Basically, that's not all because um, this, uh, this is really like a maze. <laughs> okay, home shelter here for storage. Be your yard area, helper's room, helper's en suite. That is the back door. And here, leading to your private jacuzzi and your private pool, you have your fifth bedroom and can be a guest room. En suite with the bath here. This is 
called swimming in the sky. Right here, your roof terrace, you can put in your outdoor barbecue area, your outdoor dining, and uh, that is your lap pool over there with your private jacuzzi overlooking at MBS. You have views from both sides which are totally unblocked. Just look on top. I can spend my whole day here. And now we are in the second mega penthouse in Skyline Orchard Boulevard. Right, and uh, this is a 40 unit exclusive um, apartment which was uh, TOP in 2015, designed by world renowned architect Fumihiko Baki. And so now we are going to level 33, and um, that's for us. Wow, this is the view! Alright, and this is what you get when you come home. We are right on level 33. Now this penthouse is a little bit more unique because level 33 is recommended to be a living and dining space and level 32 which is downstairs supposed to be your three bedrooms. Level 34 will be your roof terrace but the key thing is you enjoy this unblocked view for your whole apartment. You have a total of a 360 degree view as well. Just right at the forefront at Anguilla Park. So right in front of you is Orchard Iron already plus the whole sea view over here and you can still see Singapore Flyers, Marina Bay Sands together with the Orchard Skyline on the right hand side as well. So this is absolutely stunning piece of apartment that cost you $52 million. That's why it's called the Skyline and Orchard. Right, let's head back into the apartment. <laughs> Okay, so this is your entrance foyer. You can actually create a private lift lobby here with two glass panel doors. This space is your living area. Similarly, this is semi-wide. If you want your bedrooms to be on the second floor instead of level one of the penthouse, it's doable as well. Based on your imagination, how you want to configure, it's fully customizable. You can pass the floor plan to your designer to see how you want to reorganize the whole entire space. Now you can also take it um, as is as per how far it is designed it based on the floor plan. Downstairs is three bedrooms, here is living, wet kitchen, dry kitchen, and your dining space as well. Now have a look at this view from here. These are all landed properties right in front, so totally zero blockage. The whole space is ginormous. You can pre-design your entire space to your liking. This is your entire dining area and this is where the kitchen is supposed to be. Look at the space over here. It's supposed to be the wet kitchen. You can enclose it. Then this would be the dry area with the living hall. And over here would be the yard area comes the helper's room. Yeah. The key thing is that you have so much uh, outdoor and indoor space even at this area. There's a small little balcony at, um, at the back as well, together at the front. Over here, you also overlook to the north area and you can see the entire skyline from this uh, portion as well at your kitchen. And this is right at your kitchen. Right. This is the staircase to upstairs, but let's have a look at how downstairs looks like. At level 32, you can take the lift directly to all your bedrooms as well. This portion here will be the whole master suite together with a family area that is right here linking up to the balcony space. The master suite is actually designed to have a walk-in wardrobe here linking to your ensuite bath. It's up to you to configure as well. Have a look at how wide and huge is this master room. It's actually the entire dining, wet and dry kitchen space is as huge as that. The other two bedrooms are right over here. The entire floor plate for this level and upstairs is the same. We are standing at a total floor size of 9494 square feet. And this um, space is uh, configurable into two ensuite bedrooms. You can decide how you want the bedroom position to be. This view is fantastic as well. Why don't we have a look at how the roof terrace looks like. This is the favourite part of the house that I love the most. Pool deck overlooking at this whole entire skyline. This is where you chill and crash and relax and... 50... 50... how much is it? It's 50, 52 million. Yeah, 52 million. But that's not the end, it links to the other side as well. So you have another private area right over there. Another part of your private roof terrace. You can just fit in your uh, mini garden right here. Cabana, barbecue. The decking is already done by the developer. There's so much privacy overlooking at awesome skyline that you see. That is truly the pinnacle of this property. And over there, you can see our national stadium where you can have the fireworks uh, during the festival season. Um, stadium, Singapore Flyers, Marina Bay Sands. Basically, the whole entire orchard and CBD is right at your own apartment. Up next, we are going to the third and final mega penthouse and that one costs 
61 million. Yeah, 61 million is over there. It's at uh, Boulevard View. Let's check out the place with us. Now let's head up to 32nd floor. So this is the lobby of uh, Boulevard View. And uh, there's only 28 units here. Every level, there's only one unit, so it's super, super exclusive. 11,098 square feet, super huge. We have not seen uh, anything like that before as well in a, in a one unit apartment. So you own three levels, level one, level two, and third floor is a private pool, and we are going to level one right now. Right, so when you come home, this is the 11,098 square feet three-storey penthouse and just check out this enormous space that you have entire floor plate is yours literally have 360 degrees view from your living room your dining even your kitchen and all the bedrooms as you come to the view of the entire living room this is facing towards southeast and if you look closely you get to see the Singapore Flyers the sea view from there plus the sea view on the right side which is overlooking from your entire bedroom and your master room upstairs as well Orchard Iron is just next door Takashimaya, Wisma Echo is all just side by side and you have the um, Four Seasons Park Hotel just next door MRT is just below we are actually right smack in the city Come let's check out this entire dining area so you have your balcony overlooking Balmoral and this is facing towards north you get to see the entire orchard from here as well Four Seasons uh, Hotel and on the left hand side it's the entire, entire greenery view of the whole Balmoral area you have views from your kitchen you have views from your bedrooms you have views from everywhere you don't even have to go out this is basically your entire playground let's have a look at the dining area I forgot to mention this entire double volume is done on purpose so that you have a bright living room but standing here I would say that the windows panels are so well insulated that you don't really get any glaring sunlight and west is on the kitchen so you don't get any west sun in the living room and the bedrooms Alright, this is supposedly to be your island area You see this pipe here so that you can have a sink for your dry kitchen island this is where your cabinets are being built as well so Far East is going to do up all with quality finishings and materials and in case you're wondering bro why don't you share then what is this what this, is this all about this is a food lift all right so by having parties on the pool deck you want to send food upstairs to your guests or if you're hungry you call level one and say hey mom can you send me some food <laughs> this is where the food goes to the food is prepped for the kitchen and it goes right on top so this entire space is a wet kitchen can you see how bright this whole space is and you get to enjoy the totally unblocked view from level 32 when you're cooking your dishes and such a good sized yard for your washer dryer you have a helper's room here you have a powder room here not to mention you have two lifts that serves 32 and 33. The two lifts have this private lift lobby area where you can still build glass doors here as well. Full range of shoe cabinet space. Now let's head to the bedrooms. Level one has three bedrooms, all en suite. This is the first one with attached bathroom. Follow me to the second and third bedroom. Over here, you can have one large bedroom or you can combine into two, but both with en suite. Yeah, so if you notice, the rooms are all done with full glass panel giving you the indoor space you need having the uh, view from your entire bedroom space but it also has very very sizable but not too extensive balcony space which is just right outside so you can just access from your own private uh, balcony door and then it links to the whole view from your entire three common bedrooms fully en suite with luxury finishing this common room has one of the largest ensuite as well and just check out the view from the ensuite bathroom bro <laughs> yeah, you can have a bathtub here the size is fantastic as mentioned the bedrooms at level 1 is up to your configuration if you want to have one huge uh, room here or you want to make into two bedrooms it's entirely up to you but level 1 has the potential to make three bedrooms so now we are going to 33rd floor when you come to level 2 this entire space behind us is the master suite and just check out this whole space this is just like the, the entire living room of a two bedroom apartment and it's up to you to configure where you want to put your bed I mean there's just so much space you want to put your bed in the center it's, it's fine <laughs> 
<laughs> and then you have your balcony space. Definitely no problem if you have huge wardrobes. You have a lot of clothes. Even if, let's say, you want to have two bedrooms here, one as a study room, or one as a kids or toddler room, you want to be close to your baby, that's entirely possible because the space is so huge, you can segregate into two rooms. This ensuite is, uh, I think it's the size of my master room right now. Yeah, it could be. <laughs> Just check out the entire master bedroom ensuite. And the views from the bathroom is the killer. And you have an outdoor space from your master ensuite. Really, it's up to you. Where do you want to put your bathtub? There's a lot of space to maneuver and play around with. This is where the two lifts are. Best thing is you can come here and overlook level one and enjoy your living room from here. This is where your dining and your living area is. After dinner, this is a place to chill out because this is your family area. Just for the TV and nice couch here. Watch uh, Netflix. Okay. And uh, over here, we have the spiral stairs up straight to the full deck. Extremely windy. That's where we go up to level 34. Wow. Yes. And that's where the foot lift ends up with. Where's my foot? Where's my foot? Where's my foot? <laughs> The lift comes to the pool as well, so if you come home, you want to straight away jump into the pool, then just keep level 32 and 33, come to level 34 and then you can jump right in here, your own private pool. mini lab pool, build your garden here, build a mini pantry here to cheer out with your friends and your guests during the weekends. Entire space is all yours. Three full stories, 11,098 square feet, $61 million penthouse. Right downstairs is Orchard Ion. MRT is just right in front of you as well. Super convenient. Alright, so this is the last penthouse that we are showing you today, and this is 61 million. So, all in all, we show you 143 million dollars of houses. Welcome to the end of uh, today's tour of this special edition of all the In Essence Far East uh, Penthouse Collection Series. Now these are all freehold properties and if you want to have a look at this place, just give us a call. We're always happy to show you the place. Melvin Lim. Eugene Lim. Prop next. Property Lim Brothers. <laughs>